you guys are ready, can you explain what you've built? Yeah, we built a SNM module to recognize the number. Yeah, to, not, to recognize the number before here. Okay. Uh, uh, based on the CN, which is which has a convolution layer, a uh, max volume layer, and a uh, solid connector layer. And we trained our CN model through PyTorch. Um, we have we have a what's the, what's the accuracy? Uh -huh. What's the accuracy in PyTorch? I believe it's about uh, nine, 96 Yeah, got 96% uh, accuracy and we export the, the weight matrix Okay And it can be used on the FPG part And uh, yeah. just let me do a quick demo I I both three here. Um, I I put the graph. I I put what I just draw to, to the RPG. And uh, here is the 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 biggest bit. The largest bit here is a output, and it, it's five. But I I haven't drawn it, so it's right. fine. So after I run it, so I have to I have to press the uh, key one to start calculating because we don't have enough space for the SRAM. So we need to load load the data separate, load the data like two times. So uh, we press it. Oh, there's a three. Cool. There's a three. Yeah. So it recognized the three. Yeah, and uh, I the key zero is a reset, and every time we like recognize one number. The data stored in the SRAM can be totally screwed up, so we have to reload the data again through um, through the ARM side. Okay. Yeah. And also, we uh, trained our module in PyTorch, and we preload our weights to our module in the LPGA. So you trained you trained the model in PyTorch, yeah. which gives you a whole collection of weights. Yes. Yeah. And then, are those weights in floating point? Yes, yeah. uh, we use the floating point to uh, train our module, but we convert it to a fixed point. Yeah. Okay. Yeah, so there might be a loss in accuracy when yeah. we write on FPGA. Sure. Because the fixed point issue. And uh, here I made a fly. Yeah. Oh, oh. oh thanks, oh. Nate. That's okay. Oh. <laughs> so. It, it happens. Yep. It happens. Um, so you train it in PyTorch, that generates a bunch of weights in floating point. You then convert those to fixed point and load them onto the FPGA. Yes. And then you can load up a hand-drawn digit. Yes. And yes. The, the neural net is implemented in the FPGA in Verilog. Is that correct? Uh, yeah. Cool. Okay. Save it to season one. Neat. Okay, it's a lot. Cool. Yeah. And do I need to just show like ten numbers? No, 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 no. Let's maybe do. Could we do like one more? Could you? Could you draw? Or could I try to draw a seven? Yeah. Sure. So do I hold the hold this down? So I'll draw a seven. Seven and it's all seven. Awesome. Yeah. Cool. That's really nice. Thank you, guys.